I'm Mike and welcome to the Autel Training Academy. In this video I'm going to set up the IA900WA and get it ready for ADOS calibrations. The vehicle today is a 2020 Audi S6. Let's go step by step. Insert the VCI for this function. Turn on the ignition and connect the Ultra with the VCI. Then select your vehicle. The car selection menu allows customers to accurately select the correct vehicle. Once your vehicle is selected, move on to the next step. Tap ADOS Calibration. Press Fault Scan to scan the vehicle. Choose the calibration you need to perform. Select Repaired or Replaced Front Camera. The tablet will display different scenarios where the vehicle needs to be calibrated. If the floor is uneven or the mainframe and the vehicle are not on the same horizontal plane, please select B to initiate floor compensation. We will choose A. The following tools are required. Two tire clamps and targets, a pattern board, calibration frame, and a distance measuring target. Read the preparatory instructions on the screen and press set up. Move the sliding blocks to both ends. Move the sliding plate to the middle of the crossbar and make the pointer be aligned with the marked line. Loosen the handle and rotate the fine tuning bolts of the crossbar to be aligned with the marked lines. Ensure the calibration frame is at the front center of the vehicle. Press the up or down button on the back of the frame to adjust the height of the crossbar to ensure it is roughly the same height as the centers of both front wheels. Attach two tire clamps to the rear tires respectively. Place the pointer of distance measuring target at the center of the right front wheel. Press yes to enable the automatic lifting and search function to recognize the targets. Remove the distance measuring target, then move the frame so that the distance measuring value turns green. Depress two brakes to secure the frame on the ground. Rotate the bolts until the parameters turn green. Now that we have the frame set up, we can go straight into performing a specific calibration. Today we will perform an LDW calibration. Rotate the fine tuning bolts to adjust pitch and roll angles until the parameters turn green. Press OK to perform calibrations. The frame will adjust automatically to about one meter high to make it suitable to place the target board in front of the frame. Lower both target board holders. Attach the target board to the frame and fix it with two sliding blocks. Adjust the crossbar automatically to reach the standard height by pressing OK. Use a tape measure to measure heights of the four wheels and input the data. When the message displayed calibration successful, take a screenshot of the success page and add it to your post scan report. For more videos on the IA900WA, subscribe to the Autel Global YouTube channel.